guys, it is here from DIY Now, and today we're gonna be doing an emoji themed video. I love emojis so much, so that's why I wanted to make a video about them. And today what we're gonna be doing is I'm gonna be making three emoji DIYs, and I've some of, I think like one or two of them I've seen on Pinterest, and then another one I just thought up myself. So I really hope you like this, so let's get started. Just before we get started, I wanna let you all know that I hit 20 subscribers, and thank you, thank you so much to everybody who is subscribing to my channel, because it feels like amazing to me that everybody wants to watch my videos and it just makes me happy so thank you thank you so much again and also i just want to let you all know that my goal is to get 30 subscribers by august 23rd and if you guys can do that then you're gonna get an awesome video either a room tour a collab with rishi or an awesome diy comment down below which one you want to do and i'll do it uh, when i get 30 subscribers so hit that subscribe button and you'll see one of those three all right now let's get started A yellow balloon, flower, a black sharpie pen, and two yellow rubber bands. And if you don't see them, they're like right there. Okay, let's put it all together. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our balloon and we're gonna fill it up with flour as much as you can, and preferably up to here, up to here, because we want it to be filled up to as much as we can. But don't fill it up too much. And oh my gosh, this feels so good to squeeze on, especially during class on a math test. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my black marker and choose any emoji of my choice and I'm gonna draw it on here. And right after that, I'll show you the final product. And here you go, you guys, your emoji stress ball. And this feels so good. Like the flower's so soft, it makes your hand so relaxed. And it's kind of fun to like use different emojis because then if you do this, it'll make like a weird face. It's really funny. And I really like this, so let's go on to our, well, let's go on to our second um, emoji DIY. The things you'll need for this magnet will be emoji printouts, and I picked as many as I wanted, magnets, and hot glue. The first thing you're gonna do is you're going to cut out your emojis and you're gonna cut a piece of paper about as big as your hand. That's what I'd say. Alright you guys, so I just cut them all out and now what we're going to do is apply our magnets to the back of them. Okay, so here's my piece of paper and I'm going on the top I'm going to write mood and over here is where I'm going to put my emoji and basically when you put this on your locker you can magnetic your, I'm pretty sure that's not how you say it, but you're going to put like one of your emojis right here so it tells what your mood is and it's going to be really cool. I'll show an example at the um, end of this tutorial of how to make this and I'll show you how it works. Okay, so what I did is I wrote mood and poignant arrows to my emoji, and today I am feeling funny. And let's go on to, sadly, the last DIY. The next DIY is an emoji flipbook, and it's so easy and cool, and the things you will need for this project will be... I printed out an emoji of my choice, and I chose this one, and what you're going to have to do is print out two of the same emojis of the same size, and you're also going to need a composition notebook, lots of paper, scissors, hot glue, and that's it, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're going to take our composition notebook and we're gonna cut out the same exact size as our emoji. And it might be easier for you if you picked out like a very like simple emoji that doesn't have anything sticking out of its face because mine has a tongue sticking out a little bit, but that's okay. So what you're gonna do is first out, first off, cut out your emoji, which I'll do right now. Here's your second emoji, and now what we're gonna do is you're going to take like a black marker here. I think I forgot to mention that, but all you're gonna do is find like a good spot, and you're going to like you want to make this thick, 
not like flappy like that because then it'll break. So you're gonna make this thick and you're gonna trace around it and cut out two of those. Okay, so what I did is I finally got my first part here, and I'm gonna hot glue it right on here and cut out another second piece of this and hot glue this onto that. Okay, so I finally got them to the size I want. It was exactly the same, and the cardboard, thin cardboard is on the back. And now what we're gonna do is you're gonna take your emoji, you're gonna put it on the piece of paper and trace around it and cut them out and cut as many as you want, and then right after I'll show you um, the final, it's not the final product, but the final part to it. Okay, so I finished, and the way I finished is I paper clipped this on to all my pieces of paper, and I took off these little hinges by just pressing like this, and they came out. And then what I did is I hot glued the, this emoji right on here, so you can open it like this. And then I hot glued the second emoji on the back, the whole thing, because... I didn't, I, this is just a little back, you know, to hold your thing. So this is how you write it, and it's so cool and cute, and I really hope you like it. So let's show all three emojis things together. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I really hope you like it. And today we made an emoji booklet, an emoji stress ball, and emoji magnets. And I really hope you like it, like I just said. And make sure you subscribe to my channel, because my goal is to get 30 subs by the end of the summer. And for me, it is August 23rd. So please, please get me there, because it's going to be a huge accomplishment for me. And also, I want to let you all know that if we get 30 subscribers, then we can have a collaboration, a room tour, or an awesome DIY. Please comment down below which one you want to do, and whichever has the most posts, that's what we're going to do. Alright, see you, see you all in my next episode. Bye! So oh, here you go, your little emoji flip book. And I'll